Well, that was a that was my favorite episode of Moon Girl and Double Dinosaur. Really showed us more of uh just I'm forgetting his name now. Not Rolo. Her classmate, the boy. I think it was and showing how he really feels and how he knows how everyone sees him. But also the beyond her. I was a little bit the beyond her in this episode. The music number he was trying to get off and then when he finally did get music off. And Lafayette always loving her. But Moon Girl. Always let what she want get in the way in her own way, essentially. Cause she wouldn't have had no problem if she just let uh, just listened to the Beyonder. Or took her science partner seriously. I mean, it's understandable why she didn't, but in this instance, if you just listen, let him actually talk, would have a lot less problems. But also, like, his idea, I get what he's going for, and what you can, because you can use trash for a lot of things. You don't have to just throw it away. It can not be used for something creative. Yeah, they had to throw it together at last minute, though. But I really felt him um, this episode because we got to see another uh, part of him. He wanted to be taken seriously and he actually wanted to do work for his project. But I think this helped make him and her closer. Not like friends, at least not yet, but closer. I really like Beyonder and how you just, the colors in this show are just so creative and the music. Art has really been so creative in the last few years with everyone, whether it's Into the Spider-Verse, Spider Across the Spider-Verse, the TMNT movie, uh, this, the, the Lego shows, and just so many different art styles and uh, League of Legends. I don't know what it is, but art has really been in a creative run recently. But all in all, fantastic episode. Uh, can't wait till we see what happens next and next time we'll see the Beyonder.